special guest who's joining us. Rex Ryan, the former head coach of the New York Jets and the Buffalo Bills. He's now a TV star. He's on Sunday NFL Countdown and does so much around that. I mean, honestly, Rex, what can't you do at this point? Oh, that list is really long. No, uh, no, let me no. tell you. No, I, t I tell you, but it's uh, yeah. Now we were just talking about. It's like, man, I'm so used to being on TV. I was now. about I to. Let... I was a rookie. It's yeah, like you want to do years. the rest of the show? I'll I'll go out there and enjoy the day, and you can take over. Welcome to the Masters. Absolutely not. <laughs> I will say this: I have something original to say about this place. Let's hear it. No, I'm just <laughs> it's a tra it's a tradition like no other. I'm just coming up with it. it's original. You can go ahead and give it to me, but it is awesome here. That was yeah, pretty good. Yeah, it's just fantastic, though. It really is. What is your favorite thing about Augusta National Golf Club? Oh, man. I mean, really everything. I just think, really, it's crazy. You know, guys don't look at me this way, but the how beautiful it is around here. Yeah. Everybody's awesome. It's kind of different than team sports where, like, half the fans are for you. Well, in my case, 25 percent of the fans are for you 75 are against you you may be right but uh, <laughs> but it's, it's kind of cool everybody's just out have a great time watch the golfers everybody respects what they do I mean they're so talented in things and and uh, you know follow Tiger around a little bit this morning so uh, so it's great I just love being around the whole thing and I'm going to enjoy a few beers here you know this afternoon as you should what was it like following Tiger around this morning as he finished his first round of play well, I mean, it's just incredible. And I think the, the energy that's on the course, you know when Tiger Woods is on the course. Right. I mean, just there's, a, there's an energy about it. And that's when you know how big a star this guy really is. Like, the other guys are great. You know, I mean, phenomenal. Um, but when he's out there, it, it's special. And, and you see the crowds. I mean, it's funny. People will wait. All right, when Tiger's going to play, and as soon as he's done, everybody leaves. So, you know, I feel bad for the groups behind, but uh, but he's that kind of guy, and and you know, we're seeing one of the, the greatest players in the history of the sport. What are your plans for today? Because I know you've got, you know, a way to scout all this out and where you're going to go and how are you going to manage all of it? Well, you know, I have my my wife and and a couple of friends of ours, so. You know, my wife looks like she's in shape and all that type of stuff. She's rocked up and all that. But, man, she's not. So when we get to a spot, we'll walk about five holes, and then she'll want to park it there. And then, you know, so that's that's what we do. Yeah, we, we want to bring in our, our friends at home here on a little inside peek of what it's exactly like to walk this course. I'll say personally, um, I didn't think I was in great shape, but I, I now know I'm really not in great shape. <laughs> Having walked this course a lot over the last few days, I'm waking up. I got Charlie horses. I got shin splints. You know, it, it's incredible. You can't stop walking it because it's so beautiful. But there's a lot of hills going on around well, here. Well, I, I think that's what people don't understand. Yeah. Like when they like the challenge of these guys. You know, like they're walking this course, and you're like, oh, anybody walk a course? Oh, really? <laughs> no. Start walking up and down <laughs> these hills and all that. So, you know, it's not just playing the game. Like it, it's yeah. in the lies. You know, it's like, oh my goodness. You know, it, but it's it is beautiful, but the walk is challenging there's no doubt it makes it that much more impressive when people win this and, and when they win a green jacket it, it's absolutely iconic so I do know that you had a hole in one of all hole in ones uh, yes. we have a little bit of footage of some of this but I got a little bone to pick with you but first of all I want to know how did this all go down it, there you are uh, yeah that was a celebration it absolutely was a celebration and, and we're sitting back wasn't <laughs> sure if it was in there I noticed that we can't we had to cut the audio because the audio is <laughs> not, not for everybody it's not but allowed. yeah I hit it and, and look I've never had a hole in one in putt putt <laughs> you know let alone you know a real hole and things but when I hit it I'm like I think that's in like, I think that's in and sure enough there it was so once in a lifetime you know shot and and again I've never been close like yeah. not even close and sure enough the thing went in I mean I'm going to take your word for it because that was too genuine. I was going to say did a squirrel push it in but I think we saw enough of it like you did that that was yeah. That's amazing. And you, you try know, to repeat it. It's hard. I mean, you you never repeat it, right? Once well, you do I mean, once. I'm I'm praying that I do because I've a lot of my friends, almost all of them that we play with. We we're in a group. We call ourselves the Morning Ballers. My <laughs> wife calls them the Morning Bothers because at <laughs> 6:30 every morning, ding ding, I can play, I can't play, all that. But either way, 
a couple of them have hole in ones, but that's it. And especially my, you know, my buddy from Buffalo is a uh, Tim Mann uh, is a uh, uh, huge Bills fan and all yeah. that type of stuff. And and he's like, you know, I, I would love to get a second one before he ever gets a first one. Because I'm like, well, I'm my second hole in one, you know, and all this <laughs> stuff. But really, I mean, the odds are crazy. And when you're a hack like me, like it, it is brutal. You know, I watch these guys play, Laura, mm. and when they drive the ball, you know that old saying that, that there should be, a, you know, an, a uh, uh, you know a uh, uh, flight attendant on these things. They go so far, but with mine, when I tee off, there needs to be a pilot. Everything's in play. I mean, we got homes are in play. You got the roads in People, play. People, yeah. Oh. Yeah. It's it's Ford. incredible. Yeah, I don't um, yell Ford. I yell Ford, <laughs> Ford, Chevy, whatever, because it's out on the parking lot you know, somewhere. We're really. all getting a little taste of what it might be like to golf with Rex. This is incredible yeah. inside peak. I'm curious. Do you have a fondest memory of a shot maybe made here, a moment at Augusta that really sticks with you when you think about the Masters? Well, the, for me, it was you know Tiger making uh, birdie after like back surgeries and everything else. We never knew if this man would even play again. Yeah. And the fact he's out here is really cold. And then he, when he made birdie, the whole place it was like incredible. Just. You know, everybody was, I mean, high-fiving each other and everything else. It was awesome. But to see one of the greatest come back, and, and obviously we know all the back surgeries and everything else, just remarkable athlete and, and um, you know, just thankful to have an opportunity to see that. But that would be my highlight so far. But you never know. Hopefully somebody else will see another one this weekend.